Is cloning good or bad? We help you decide. A clone is an identical copy of another creature. It's sort of like having an identical twin brother or sister, but much younger than you. There are two types of cloning. Reproductive cloning, in which an individual is created who is identical to someone else, and research cloning, designed to produce healthy cells that can replace diseased cells. As long as you don't clone a conscious human, then no one gets hurt, so it's okay. Research cloning can lead to some cures for some diseases that are very difficult to treat. Like in the case of Alzheimer's, somebody who's afflicted with the disease could receive a treatment coming from stem cells and they could be cured. Or somebody who's paralyzed, in turn, could have their nerve cells treated with stem cells and then maybe be able to walk again. It would be cool to have a clone. People would say, hey, there's the guy who has a clone. Or his clone. Reproductive cloning is a criminal act in a number of countries, including Canada. But studies into research cloning is still ongoing in many countries, such as South Korea, Italy, and the United Kingdom. It's natural to want to make copies of yourself. That's why we had kids. How wrong we were.